Today I'm going to show you how to program the G keys on the Corsair Vengeance K95 keyboard. First thing we need to do is go down to the taskbar, come over here on the right and click the show hidden icons arrow and click it. And come up here to the icon for the keyboard, click that once. Then come down onto this thing that pops up and click that. Now these four buttons right here are on the keyboard. You can program program the keyboard using the buttons on the keyboard without bringing up the software. But it's easier to do it using the software. You can see what you're typing better and gives you more options. So first, I've already programmed the 18 keys using M1 and M2. So I'm going to do M3. Then I'm going to choose a key. So I'm going to go with G1. And it says assign key G1. So we've got to give it a name. So we're going to click in this box and give it email one. Now to record the macro, we come up here to the MR and click it. Now we have to click the G1 button again and just type the uh, email address. After you type your email, click the record button again. And that key is programmed. Let me show you, I'll bring up Word. And I'll push the G1 key. And you see how it typed out each individual letter like I was actually typing it? Well, you can get rid of that delay. I'll show you how to do that. So we got to go Choose a different key. We'll go with G2. Call it uh, email2. Click delay options. Then choose over here. Ignore delays. Then come up here and choose the record button again. Then choose G2. And start typing. and click the record button again and then bring back up Word and push G2. You see how it popped up instantly? Let me show you again. Here's G1. Types it out. G2 pops it up. And that's how you do text. And now you can also program it to open a program. So I'm going to come over here and choose the G3 key. I'm going to give it a name, browser. And then I'm going to come down here and choose advanced options. And there's basic commands and advanced commands. Want advanced. And you come down here where it says launch program and click it. And then you click the plus sign, and it pops up where your programs are, the program folder. And scroll through it. I'm looking for Mozilla, Firefox. I've got it right here. And then I'm going to scroll down. And come over here, and click on Firefox Execute, and click open. And now that key is programmed. I'll push G3 and it pops my browser. Now I'll close this. Now this this can be programmed to do a lot more. I don't know how to do any of it. I just know how to do these two basic things. Type text and launch programs. And if you uh, decide you don't want to button programmed for a particular task anymore. Just go to the button and right click it. 
and choose delete. Now when you click on another key, you see G1 and G2 are blue. That means they're programmed. And G3 is no longer blue. So it's not programmed to anything. And when you're done, come down here and click close and everything is saved. And that's the basics for programming the Corsair Vengeance K95 keyboard. I haven't forgotten about the Global Barrel video. The guy I buy my barrels from is out right now and he sells them for half as much as anybody else does around here so I'm gonna wait. Sorry for the delays guys. Thanks for all my, all my new subscribers and all the old subscribers that are sticking with me. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Like it, please give it a thumbs up. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Good luck. Bye.